They sent up the nest, the nest box scheme to find out if the birds in there would control the pests on, on the nursery, the Nags Head nursery. And uh, it's been running ever since. So it's been running now for, I don't know, it's the longest running nest box scheme in Britain, I think. So is that still measured? Do they still assess this? Yeah, still, still check. Now, I don't think it's anything to do with the, with the effect of the insect population. They were more dependent on it, really. And of course, the birds in the nest box schemes then were dependent on the caterpillar plagues, which used to get on the oak trees. But they're known from historical times that the caterpillar plagues occurred from time to time. What's a caterpillar plague? They're made, they're, they were mainly oak leaf rolling moth, but the, the caterpillars uh, would actually shred a lot of the leaves on the oak some years and used to get big flocks of rooks and things who would come in from outside and gobble up all these things. Uh, but they discovered, when they went initially went to check the boxes, they found that there were several pairs of pied flycatchers nesting in boxes, which nobody ever knew they'd ever seen before in the forest. And that went on to become a study area for particularly poor pied flycatchers over a considerable number of years and produced quite a lot of useful information mm. on breeding biology, uh, around breeding success and that sort of stuff.